Hi, this is a tutorial for the new eDrums app in Laser OS. The first thing that you want to do is make sure that in your settings that you've got your MIDI input set up to match the output of the drum machine that you've got plugged in. When you go to the eDrum app for the first time, you go to edit mode. You want to make sure that you erase all the drum kit calibration data. So you're starting with a clean slate. And with edit mode on, the first thing you do is you hit your first pad. And then using the arrow keys, you can position the pattern to the pad that you just hit. By using shift in combination with the arrow keys, you can adjust the size, and once you have a pattern mapped to your drum pad, hit S to save it. And then we'll do a second pad. We're going to change the color on that with this slider. We'll position it to the second pad. You can change how fast the pattern moves with the arrow keys by using this slider. Right now I have it in the coarsest position. We'll save that. Go to the third pad. We'll change the color on this one. And again, with the shift plus arrow keys, adjust the size. We'll save that with the S key. On this next pad, by hitting the T, we can change the shape of the pattern from a square to an X to a triangle and then back to a circle. So on this, let's make it an X. We'll take the width and height down. Let's save that. And finally, for our last pad, we'll change the shape of this to a triangle. We'll change the color to green, and we'll save that. Now when we come out of edit mode, as we hit each pad, the shape that we programmed is mapped to the pad. This control controls how quickly the pattern fades away. So at a higher setting, it only appears briefly or at a lower setting, it takes a while to fade away. And you can also turn on this rotation effect, which is pretty cool. So each time you hit the drum, you get a rotation. So once you're all set up, you can play patterns on a drum machine. And of course, it's going to play back that pattern. Let's take the decay down. Taking the same idea, you can map the pads on a full-size electronic drum kit. This is an Alesis Nitro mesh kit with its MIDI output plugged into the computer. And each pad drummer symbol sends a MIDI note that Laser OS transforms into the shape that is positioned. The eDrum app is really a lot of fun. Enjoy.